<laughs> like I would like have started crying like instantly. Stop it! Heavy, 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 heavy traffic. Just like my heavy ass breathing. See, the thing is, like with me, I'm like, okay, like I know what I'm gonna talk about. Cause in my YouTube channel, like I gotta kinda plan the topics. I was like, okay, I know what I'm gonna talk about. And of course, when I start writing, I, I forget. It's not like we're a motorcycle channel or anything, so. Also, I should, should have not uh, closed my eyes when I did that, cause I, I forgot that I was writing. We have a motorcycle, let's just. Somebody else, so I hear you crying, ask for help. Like, uh, just in case you didn't know, I am the boy with the uke. Wow, you better off of I gotta start posting on TikTok more, but those videos just take a lot out of me. Actually, they don't. Why did I say that? <laughs> YouTube videos take a lot of me. And like, oh, I don't know if you guys know this, but right now, social media is like my full-time job. Oh, I gotta... Stop it! YouTube, I've made $1.34. Instagram, I have made 17 cents. Patreon helps out so much. I don't think you guys understand how much Patreon helps me out, actually. It gives me like a little bit of like a comfort of like, just in case a video doesn't do well or anything, because I can see that that's like consistent. And that, that helps me out. It helps me not stress about like paying bills or whatnot. Merch coming soon. Oh my god, this video is already so fucking boring. Holy fuck. There's not much going on right now. It's just like, it's like a slow period. Even though my account right now is the biggest it's ever been, I honestly think my peak was early November. Like the first two weeks of November. Oh, fuck. I think that's when I made my first garlic bread video. Or even a little bit before that because it was like i was able to just post whatever the fuck i wanted and there was like no repercussions like i guess now i still can but it's like a little different because before like if i made a stupid typo and everything and i only had like a couple thousand followers it was like okay whatever you know like it's silly but like now when i do the 800 000, i'm like damn these probably, these people were probably like how the fuck does this guy how the fuck does this guy have so many followers He's fucking, he can't even spell literally properly. The thing is like, I don't like care <laughs> about like social media. But not like, like, obviously I care about you guys. Cause you guys are like, uh, you guys are not fans. It, it's, it's like a little, it's like a little family. Like, I love it. I try doing high quality stuff, but I'm talking about like when it comes to other things that aren't important, it's like, it's not important. Cause at the end of the day, it's just entertainment. You know, the whole point is to be entertaining, trying not to post boring stuff. I try like, making, well, for me, since I rewatch the video so many times, um, I go back and rewatch them and I'm like, I, I kind of enjoy them. Like, I'm not trying to sound cocky or anything, but I enjoy watching my own videos, my old TikToks. Like, I don't want to be like those creators that like, oop, just post something and then like, it's like a one-time thing, you know, like fucking like Charlie D'Amelio. Like, I bet no one goes and just like strolls through her dances like for fun, but I do that on my own account. Maybe I'm being conceited, maybe I'm being cocky, maybe, I don't know. Um, maybe I'm hopping myself up. What? What? Like, I cut out a lot of stuff, but then I'm like, would people find this entertaining? Because it's like a one type thing, like, I ask, I ask to talk about like one sentence or whatever. But since I find it boring to so, like, after I watch it for the 10th time, I just delete it. And I have the Patreon for that, uh, to post the, uh, the extra content. But honestly, my Patreon has become more of an only, <laughs> but not in that way. I just. Leave me alone, okay? Maybe if you guys want that, I will do that. Or maybe a second channel. Maybe that will be more of a possibility i could post like my extra tiktoks or a second tiktok account and like post like the longer like, like longer videos Oop. of course i fucking hate it when people do that shit get off your fucking phone dude did you guys see that she was on her fucking phone old ass grandma fucking holy shit i fucking hate people. sorry i i love old people Oop, i barely made that i haven't hit anyone's mirror yet on this bike i mean i haven't hit anyone's mirrors on any bike <laughs> this bike hurts if you're um going slow like it, it destroys my back not in the way i like does anyone want to peck i'm just kidding i'm joking <laughs> i don't know what i'm gonna do that see that would be a good clip for the second channel see that's a great example oh i just got my fucking feet stuck on the pegs please someone peck no, <laughs> Thank you, truck. Oh my god, when truck drivers notice you? What? Before, when I was a car guy, I will like challenge every other car guy to like a race. But as a bike guy, or bike ride rider, bike ride, bike, they, they ride a car over 3,000 pounds. I need to have like at least like 500 horsepower or 600 horsepower for it to be, holy shit. Or maybe that fucking Kia Soul, holy fuck. There's a very high chance that I've driven past one of you guys. Like very high. Like almost guaranteed that it's happening <laughs> at this point with like 1.5 million people there's a good there's a good chance right i want it my way oh 
man. I knew he was into that too. You guys notice I didn't fucking beat his ass? No, I'm just kidding. Oh, there's someone standing right there. <gasps> oh my gosh, he's dripping. Okay. I didn't mean it like that. The only one I want dripping is my girlfriend. Pixie, but not with like oil or anything. Oh, um, I'll have a little like Oh, that one's for me. Good boss. Thank you. Have a good day. Yeah, it's a thousand. You used to ride? Oh, yeah. I had a CBR 600. Oh, nice. 2004? 2004? Big accident. Mm hmm. Tire blow up, no control. The rear tire blow up, bro. You can control for 40 miles an hour. Mm hmm. Wait, let me see if I got any more for you, boss. Here you go. Thank you, boss. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay. You had to put a bar like this. Yeah, the crash bars. My friend has one. When you fell down? Uh huh. Sometimes when you go in the rain, when you fell down, bicycle fell down like a top. Mm hmm. You don't have no time to put. Then you hit your leg. Your leg here. Hit. So when you have a bar, bar gonna hit the bicycle, your leg gonna be safe. But that's, leg, that's right. You gotta scan the road, bro. You know, like, always when you stop the red light, before the red light, you have to scan behind. Mm -hmm. Freeway, you have to keep going. Yeah, we can't stop on the freeway. Alright, it was nice talking to you, bro. See you later, bro. Nice See you later. Of course. <sighs> Holy fuck, I feel so bad. Holy shit. Oh my god, I'm like so sad. I can't imagine how that fucking must have felt. Like, imagine. Like, I don't wanna. I'm gonna start fucking crying. Holy shit. Like, imagine, like, you used to ride and shit. Right? I'm trying to imagine. Imagine I used to ride and then I, like, crash and then, like, something else happens and I'm homeless and then I see, like, some biker pull up. Like, I would, like, have started crying, like, instantly. Whoa. You gotta refer everyone that looks at you. That's just that's just how it is. That's the rule. I don't make the rules. I just made well I just made that one, but damn. I'm fucking sad now. Holy fuck.